Hi guys, my name is Emily, and today I'm here to wrap up my Booktubeathon reading experience. I did manage to complete all of the little reading challenges for inspiration that Ariel Bosset set out in her one video, and so I will show those to you now. From the medley, The Slow Regard of Silent Things by Patrick Rothfuss, and Waiting for Joe by Sandra Birdsell. This happened on my very first day of the Booktubeathon. I was very successful, persevered, all day reading, just reading wonderfulness. So I accomplished a lot. Uh, the second day I worked towards the challenge of reading an author whose surname started with the same letter as my surname, so an S, and so I read two Shakespeare plays, The Winter's Tale and A Midsummer Night's Dream. Again, a very successful day. Um, day two, just a solid day of reading. Day three, I had some adulty things to do, and so half the day was running errands, and then I started When Harley Was One by David Gerald, which is my sister's favorite book. I was working towards reading someone else's favorite book, and um, this, this is where everything went wrong. Picking someone else's favorite book I probably should have left till last, because this is science fiction. It's not 100% to my taste. Usually when I pick out science fiction, I enjoy it because I have picked something that is in my realm of interest, and this isn't 100% in my realm of interest. So this really bogged me down, so I spent day three, four, and five reading this. I finally finished it on the Friday night, Saturday morning, and then I did the read a book without letting go of it. I read The Magic Finger by Roald Dahl. This is a very cute little story, very quick to read, had lots of pictures. The last two challenges I ended up combining, which was to read something that I really wanted to read and read something that I had recently acquired. And so I had recently acquired Looking for Alaska by John Green in a used bookstore haul. So I wanted to read this and I wanted to complete all the challenges, so I combined them. I don't know if that's cheating. So I finished this in a morning. It was, I think this is my favorite John Green book. So I have read Looking for Alaska, Paper Towns, and The Fault in Our Stars now. And um, I think I like this one the best. I might do a full review of this to explain why. So maybe look out for that in the future. In reading all of these things, I did actually manage to complete the seventh challenge, which was to read se seven books. So I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I managed to better that and actually read eight. So um, overall, pretty proud of myself, pretty happy with what I managed to accomplish in this past week. I wasn't as involved as I would have liked to have been. All the adulty stuff kind of got in the way, especially later in the week but I still had a lot of fun reading. Um, I hope you guys had a really good booktubeathon. Let me know if you participated in the comments below. If you want to link me to your wrap up, I'd like to see how you guys did. Chat with me, link me to things. Thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.